It's theme time again! Today we're excited to present DevStack, our new theme package for WordPress and Joomla. It's perfect for software as a service, app or any other product-related websites. This is the first theme in a long time that switches the focus from dynamic content back to design and style. For DevStack, we mix the two currently most popular design trends – neomorphism and glassmorphism – to create a unique look. DevStack also comes with 16 modern page layouts, great-looking styles and many handcrafted icons and illustrations. Let's take a look! DevStack has 16 different layouts for all kinds of page types. They can be easily loaded from the layout library with just a click. Here's a walkthrough of all the highlights. The home page shows the product hero section with a presentation video, followed by multiple feature sections. Next comes an overlay slider with the latest customer stories. The page ends with the call to action section and latest blog posts. The white DevStack page is a features page. It shows the feature navigation to dedicated sections, presenting the features one by one. The highlights of this page are two panel sliders for third-party integrations. They have a smooth effect due to the different autoplay interval. The page ends with a pricing section. Similar to the page before, the Enterprise page shows the feature navigation, but in a primary section. Each feature section stands out with its own layout. The customer stories are presented in an overlay slider, followed by a grid with community benefits. There is also a pricing section at the bottom. The pricing page shows all subscription plans. You can even switch between monthly or annual pricing. Next comes a table comparing the plans followed by frequently asked questions. There's also a typical support page that starts with a prominent search bar at the top, followed by grids and lists to the documentation, hot topics, popular tutorials and recommended articles. The Feature Index page is a completely new layout type. It shows a full list of all features with a short description and a link to their detail page. There is a sidebar on the left linking the specific feature groups to their sections. The About page shows the information about the company and its values. There is also a small sub nav to further company pages. The office images are shown in an overlay slider, followed by the company team presented in a masonry grid with a slight parallax effect. Next comes a panel slider with quotes from different team members. Our story is our first timeline page. It starts with a hero section, followed by a timeline showing company's progress over the years. As the name suggests, the Careers page is used to present all open positions. It starts with a beautifully arranged hero section, followed by a list of benefits and an image gallery. Of course, there is also a list of open positions, as well as a call to action. The Job Description page is a detailed page for a specific position. It provides all the needed information like responsibilities, qualifications and a contact link. DevStack also has a blog page that shows the latest news in a three-column layout. It starts with a newsletter sign-up and a sub-nav to filter posts by category. The post category page looks the same as the page before, but without the newsletter at the top. Instead, there is a link back to the blog page. The post page starts with the post image. The post itself is shown in a three-column layout, with the content in the center, meta information on the left, and author information on the right. The sidebar on the left also shows post tags, as well as links to social media profiles. Latest posts are shown at the bottom. The author page starts with an author image, name and description. It's followed by all author posts displayed in a three-column layout. 
There's also a search page with a search form on the support page. The search results are shown in a one-column layout. Finally, DevStack has a clean 404 error page with a link back to the home page. In order to create a pricing table, which allows switching between monthly and annual subscription plans, we came up with the idea of using the grid element and its filter option. Not bad, right? But for a common pricing table, we had to add some new options to the grid element. So you can now set a different panel style and link text for each grid item and the button can now take the full width of the card. To emphasize the new morphic style, DevStack uses absolutely positioned images in the background across all layouts. These white squares fade in, protruding from the background, which creates even more depth. Since the hero sections of why DevStack and Enterprise pages contain many animated elements in addition to the background squares, the default animation delay of 200 milliseconds took too long. That's why we added a new option for the delay time to speed things up. DevStack is all about neomorphism, also called soft UI. Elements in the background have the same color, and using shadowing and light creates the feel that elements like buttons and cards are protruding from the background. Forms, on the other hand, sink into the background, adding another layer of depth. To achieve this, we added new box shadow options across many UI components to the style customizer. Even the dividers have a subtle shadow effect. A pale color scheme and round borders create a silky smooth surface, while flashy gradients bring attention to active states and important UI elements. To refine the style even more, we added a little bit of glass morphism, which is why the sticky nav bar has a frosted glass effect using a background blur. Finally, DevStack has bold typography with a sans serif font. In addition to the default style, DevStack comes with five other style variations, each with a different beautiful color scheme. There are three light styles and two dark ones. Of course, you can switch the whole look and feel of your website with just a click. Simply choose what fits your website best. To create a frosted glass effect for the sticky nav bar, we added the backdrop filter option to blur the background. There is also an additional mode for the navbar border, which only shows the border when the navbar is sticky. And finally, there is a new slide mode for the navbar line, which starts the line animation from the center, expanding it to both sides. We added a new transform option to all cards. This allows us to reposition the card on hover. Together with the box shadow animation, it creates an interactive look as if the card is being pushed down. What comes next is something we're especially proud of. We created unique animated SVG illustrations for all DevStack features. In the background, we have a large neomorphic icon. On top, a square is floating with a subtle parallax animation. It has a frosted glass effect using a background blur and displays a vibrant icon. It was a bit tricky to get them working across all browsers, but we did it. For some features, we created animated background SVG images using a subtle parallax effect. Smaller features are presented using neomorphic squares with vibrant icons. There are even more other icons that show DevStack features. Of course, you can change their color and use them with any style. Since DevStack does not focus on content structure, it only uses dynamic content for its blog and post pages. So the default post has three custom fields to tease the post on other pages. In Joomla, we added five custom fields to display the author avatar, biography and links to social media profiles. While in WordPress only two custom fields were added, since the rest is available by default. DevStack comes with more than 40 lovingly curated and free-to-use images. They can be found in the DevStack collection in the Unsplash library. So these are the features of our new DevStack theme package for WordPress and Joomla. Now go ahead and explore it yourself. 
As always, we're looking forward to your feedback, so let us know what you think in the comments below.